Hi everyone. Uh, Tonight I uh, met up with the mom of a uh, little gal who had Clyde. I believe she's around 13. And uh, she packed up the last of his food and his... Isn't this cute? I'm not really sure what it was for, but maybe it was to clean the cage. <laughs> um, but, but look at this. This is a good nail clipper. It really is. Um, unfortunately, the guinea pig diet is, you know, and people don't understand. They don't know. You know, it's not their fault. It's not the best. And I, I'm not in a position to refuse food right now since I have 16 guinea pigs. I'm grateful for it. But just so you know, this is Wild Harvest. It's um, widely available, like at Walmart and that. And, but the problem with it is it's got wheat middlings, dried alfalfa, ground corn, soybean, and then Timothy hay. So, and, you know, it's not the, it's not the worst, but... <laughs> But I'll mix it with, with mine. I'm still glad to have it. Um, they used KT hay, which is just fine. But this is what really made me, you know, it's, it's like the little notes that kids give when, when they have to give up their pet. And she had to give up her pet because of allergies. And, and her mother said that she just didn't have time. And 13 is when they start getting so busy. But this just about made me cry. This is Clyde. He is two years old. He is a teddy bear, guinea pig. He loves to eat three leaf clovers in the spring and summer. Clyde also loves to sit on his log in his purple hut. He will also tip his log or his hut upside down. Please love and take care of him. I will. I promise. I promise I will take care of Clyde. You do not have to worry, dear. And I'm sorry that you couldn't keep him. Hi, Clyde. Well, he's in a good place. You know, we're going to take good care of him. But, you know, notes like that just... It's like, this is my dog. Please always love him. I can't keep him anymore, you know, and... I haven't seen a note like that for a long time. So, Clyde, your little girl really did love you. She did. I don't know her name, and that's fine. Because I'd prefer to keep the families anonymous anyway. But that was really a sweet little note. Yeah. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. So, we're okay, buddy. And I brought his cage in. It's a lot bigger than the cage I have him in. I just have to figure out how to get him and Teddy next to each other. Uh, not in the same cage, though. It would be wonderful if they could be bonded, but honestly, I don't see it as happening because they're both two, and <laughs> they've always been the king of their own castle. So, right, Teddy? Yeah. Okay, everybody. Bye.